the guys rise up 44 here playing the division. Uh, as you see here, I'm at the special equipment vendor. And that's because it's Friday night. And that means it's weekly reset time. Uh, the vendors just reset a little bit ago. And I am here to show you what they brought with them since reset. Alright, so special equipment vendor upstairs in the uh, base of operations. You're gonna like what you see. He now has again a historian, but now he has a tactical vector, tactor M1911, and a military M870. Let's check out the tactical vector. 204 gear score, 825 Phoenix credits, 90,241 DPS, 11.2 thousand damage. Let's see, this one has talent, uh, let's see, skilled, adept, and vicious. This actually is not a bad vector if you don't already have one or something, you know, a different uh, SMG like. Yeah, it's not a bad weapon. Um, hmm. Alright, so that's the, the tactical vector. Moving on. We have the tactical M1911. This one has a 204 gear score. 659 Phoenix credits, 60,348 DPS, 12.7 thousand damage. Uh, this one has expert, talented, um, let's see, well, it's actually not bad at all, it's got 12.7 damage. Um, 659 Phoenix credit. You know what? I'm gonna buy this. Um, this is this has got high damage. You know, base damage right out of the box. This is this is actually a really nice uh, handgun. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and buy that one. All right, moving on. Military M870. 60,681 DPS. 74.3 thousand damage. This one has stable and determined. 182 gear score, 223 Phoenix credits. You will probably pass on this one, especially since it's only got a 182 gear score. Um, everything else here at the special uh, equipment vendor is all the same. Hey, catch so you another time. moving on, we'll check the vendor downstairs. See if he has anything new. Probably not. But we'll check anyway. How's my new favorite right, He has the pack in Cassidy Centurion still. Okay, no so worries. he hasn't Come changed. It doesn't seem like he's going to change anytime soon. Moving to the dark zone. I'll meet you guys in there. Alright, so as you guys see, I made it to the dark zone. We're in uh, dark zone 5. Made it to the safe house here. And well, this safe room has Stop fucking around. Buy from me. the attachments. This week he has a pro red dot site for thirty one thousand six hundred and fifty six dark zone credits and a small group red uh, for eleven thousand fourteen dark zone credits. Um, both are at level 30, one's, well, one's a level 31, the pro red dot site is a level 31, the small grip is a level 30, rank 40 and rank 25 you need to be, and the blueprints for the suppressor, the laser, and the extended mag are also at this uh, safe house. Come on, I'm desperate here. So, nothing too, uh, nothing too great about what this safe house has to offer here in Dark Zone 5, moving on to, uh, Dark Zone 3 and Safe House 3 West. Dark Zone 3 and came in the West set, the West End safe room. So let's see what Dark Zone 3 vendor has for us. Yeah, you know what you're looking at. Alright, classic M1A. 182 gear score for 56,000 Dark Zone credits. This one has Swift, re Restored, and Sustained. You have to be rank 40. 77,000 DPS, 36,000 damage. 
Next is the Military Scar H. Uh, that's the Marksman Rifle. This one is a 163 gear score. 19,503 Dark Zone credits. I don't even know why somebody would spend that many Dark Zone credits on a 163 gear score weapon. Uh, this one has Deadly, Sustained, and Stable. This is a really good roll though. Why couldn't it be a 204? Then it would definitely be worth it. Next we have a Classic RPK 204 gear score for 95,508 Dark Zone credits. 204 gear score, rank 80. Um, this one has Capable, Swift, and Brutal. This is a, also a pretty good roll for RPK. 92,898 DPS. 7,566 damage. Um, this one's not bad for uh, LMG. Uh, next we have an AUG. Nice, an AUG. 204 gear score. 96,412 Dark Zone credits. You have to be rank 80. Uh, this one has 85,594 DPS with 10.7 thousand damage. Um, this one has Adept, Competent, and Provident. Uh, not such a good roll, but still, um, you know, if you don't have a uh, AUG, then, you know, you might want to pick this one up. Let's see here, we have the Valkyrie Blueprint. Oh, never mind, don't pick that one up. Save up, get the Tactical AUG A3 Blueprint. It's a 204 gear score. It is 212,876 Dark Zone credits. A little pr that's a little pricey, especially how long it takes to get Dark Zone credits. Uh, that's going to take you some time. But if you can get that and you are rank 75, go for this Tactical AUG Blueprint. I might actually save up and get this Blueprint because the one I have is a 182. Um, yeah, I mean, I was saving up for the Valkyrie, but I mean, I might as well just wait on the Valkyrie and because that's going to be here for a while and get this tactical AUG this week. Um, the other ones like uh, normal are the M60 and the SASG. Um, those have been there forever. But yeah, this is this is actually a really good blueprint. Um, go ahead and get this if you can. If you're rank 75 and you have the Dark Zone credit, grab this, um, this AUG blueprint. So that's going to wrap up this week's uh, vendor reset. Thanks for watching. Follow me on Twitter at RiseUp44. Click that like button on this video. Subscribe to my channel, Navio Gaming. And I appreciate it. Hey, we'll see you next week. Later, guys. You.